glad you helped me, Javi. But I can't stop wondering how things might be different if you hadn't. Maybe Gabe wouldn't be with Mariana right now. They deserved better, Javi. Better than us. Gabe. Mariana. This wasn't our fault. This was David. It was all of us. Usually the quiet scares me. What about now? There's a lot of work to be done. The herd could come back. Still, though, I feel more calm here than... than I ever did in an old van on streets with no streetlights. We earned this, Javi. We earned feeling calm in the quiet. Let's start a family. You and me. A fresh start. What do you say? I think it'd be good for us. You're on. Let's start a family. You don't think it's selfish? It's not the safest world outside of Richmond. Or inside it, truth be told. So long as I got you, I'm not too worried about it. <sighs> we'll be up there before we know it. Better do something worthwhile in the meantime. Head now? Yes, indeed. We came here to put an end to the raiding. Looks like that's been done. Glad we got it settled. Gotta move on. We lost a lot. We may have helped fix things, but... There was a cost to it all. There usually is, unfortunately. I was worried about you, Javi. About who you are inside. You helped save these people, though. That goes a long way for me. Second chances are in short supply these days. That's what this place can be, if you let it. Trust me, though. Life within walls is a hell of a lot different than life on the road. Don't take shortcuts like Joan. You gotta do the right thing. Always. Good days, and especially bad. Absolutely. The right thing. No matter what. Good to hear. I read people pretty well. A little gift of mine. You're a capable guy, Javi. Change is in the air here. You can lead that change, and I think you should. For the better. God knows this town could use it. You know what? I'm gonna step up. Lead this place in the right direction. Then as far as I'm concerned, Richmond's in much better hands than it was. Be vigilant. Trouble never stays too far away. You're alive. Don't remind me. I'm not gonna say thank you for keeping me alive. But I'm gonna try and find something out there that might make me say thank you. Someday. So where's AJ? Tell me. Where? Start saving your soul today. Tell us where AJ is. Don't know how much of that soul I got left. Please. What the hell? He's in McCarroll Ranch. It's not too far from here. That's... 
That's where we left him, at least. Thank you. Good luck out there, Doctor. So you're out of here too, huh? Yeah. It's time. I have to find AJ Javi. I've waited so long. But could you do me one last favor before I leave? to do this for my niece. That's nice of you. She thought I was terrible at it. Were you? Not your business. I have to see AJ Javi. I have to see that he's okay. Do you think he remembers me? At least a little? Maybe? Who could forget you, Clem? No one who knew you, I guarantee it. Yeah, maybe. Everyone told us he was better off. After everything that's happened, I'm starting to think they're right. I don't know if I was a good mom or not. I can't stop thinking about it. I really wish I could. Did you love him? With all of my heart. And of course you were. Gabe told me you used to play baseball. I did. I loved it. He told me you fucked it all up, too. Yep. Sure did. Well, you survived. I had to. But you loved it. How do you survive that? How? If you really loved it, how? You get back out there and find something better. There may not be something better out there. You won't know until you step outside. All done. Well, how's it look? You know what? I'll grab your hat. <laughs> I remember this team. Your dad ever teach you about baseball? No, not really. Well, you come back, and I'll tell you all about it. It's a deal. If I bring AJ back with me, will you teach him too? You bet. He belongs with you, Clementine. Bring him back. <laughs>